<laughs> what up? Welcome back to another video, guys. Another beautiful day out here in dirty Jersey. Blue skies, clear skies, as you can see. We're on my 2021 Road Glide special today. Um, this is going to be a quick video. I just want to touch base upon one thing because uh, I made it perfectly clear what bike I was selling before and what I wanted to trade for this bike. But there was still some confusion. So I know a lot of you guys have been asking me, what bike did you trade for the Road Glider? <laughs> I was going to say Road Glider, as <laughs> What bike did you change for the Road Glide? Um, and that's the Dyna, guys. I, I changed the Dyna. I traded it in. There's no way that I would sell or get rid of my uh, Lowrider S. There's just no way. Uh, that's that's just my baby and it's no not happening i know that i um entertained the uh, the idea before of uh trading that bike in back back then back when i wanted this bike originally when it came out but obviously no um so yes in the garage now we have the 2021 road glide the 2020 low rider s and the 2019 monstrous boisterous powerful iron 883 <laughs> so i originally posted um a picture on youtube and i think i did it on my instagram where i said that dyna was being uh, for sale it was gonna be sold um and then i was gonna put it up in the market and i and i was gonna you know just put it up for sale somewhere but i, I honestly didn't want to deal with that i don't i don't want to deal with people and showing the bike and this and that and i i, I hate that man I, I hate the little people and flopping no, no I'm, I'm good so i was like you know what let me just let me, let me just trade it in and call it a day sometimes is uh what's that old saying sometimes it's better to lose money than what is it sometimes it's better to lose money You know, you know that saying where it's like, you know, it's better to lose money than deal with a headache. Anybody knows the saying, <laughs> drop it down below, please. I'm like scattered right now. Um, so yeah, obviously I don't want to deal with that. I want to just trade it into the dealership and that's it. Um, and then the way it happened, it was literally me just walking in to uh, my local dealership. And um, I went in there literally just to just to talk numbers if anything because they had this bike and um garden state didn't have this color so i literally just went into just 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 to talk hey how much how much is it you know like what what would you in case what were you able to do and then i wanted to go home and talk about the numbers and everything and then when they were you know they were like oh you know what if you really want it we'll do this for you right now and blah 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 and i'm like all right well how much we give me for a trade-in for the dyna i got it outside they looked at it everything was fine they gave me a pretty fair price for it as well um and then at that point it was like fuck it <laughs> it's, a, it's a, just whatever it's a, it's a no-brainer i went in there just to talk numbers and i came out with my dream bike right so amazing day uh, if you've ever seen that video of me shopping for the bike and, and the video of me taking the bike home, check that out, scroll down below, um, pretty good stuff. But yeah, guys, I, I did not sell the low rider S, still in the garage, and I'll show you right now when we get there. Um, what, I, what I will say is that uh, I'm very happy with my decision. I've yet to look back uh, and think about that bike. People ask me, oh, so do you miss the Dyna? I'm like, not for a second. Like, I literally haven't sat down and, and be like, oh, oh, damn, I miss that bike. Like, no. Even me riding this bike out of the dealership that night and the bike, the Dyna was still outside in the parking lot. I didn't even look at it. It's like, you know, like, oh, like, say your goodbyes. Like, oh, my baby, we have such great memories. Oh my God, no, no. No, nah, it was like, all right, well, bye. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. Bye. Let's do a uh, little walk around the bike. It's only right, right? Uh, what do you guys think about this um, red and black two-tone paint job? And what do you guys think about the chrome? I'll tell you something right now. Chrome is coming back. Chrome.
chrome is definitely coming back, man. Look how clean everything looks. Originally, I wanted the black one back when this bike um, first emerged in January. I wanted all blacked out special, but I'm, I'm very happy with my decision to go with the chrome. It's just beautiful. And give it another year or two. Give it maybe uh, two more years. Everybody's going to be wanting chrome bikes again. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. Well, let me, uh, let me uh, show you guys the proof that the bike is still here. <laughs> She's filthy, though. Um, so we definitely got to wash her. She's dirty, dirty. There she is. You dirty little girl. My 2020 low rider S and this monster. Look at this bike. It's not a girl's bike. It's an R-83 and I'm Batman. Oh, just really quick, look. Uh, we got these gold uh, accent bolts. Um, got these from San Jose Customs. San Jose Customs is the same um, company that makes these risers. So definitely stands out a lot. Pretty, pretty cool. Um, yes, I, there will be more Low Rider S content. I know that late, lately it's just been either <laughs> the, the, the Road Glide and then the Iron. And I've kind of been neglecting this bike here for a little bit. Um, but yeah, more Low Rider S content coming. Obviously, tons and tons of Road Glide content coming as well so tune in if that's what you're into you're definitely in the right place go ahead hit that like button that subscribe button and uh i'm gonna catch you guys in the next one like always baby let the force be with you ride safe and enjoy the ride baby peace